All right, this for a recording, we're going to go ahead and start uh, modeling off uh, our form here. So I'm going to go ahead and create a polygon cube and size it down a bit. And again, we are only going to model uh, half of it. So I'm going to go ahead and start setting this up um, just for one half. All right, so we did put uh, our model so we can see it. So we pushed it back so we can see through it. Now, if we had our uh, image plane halfway through, we would have had some issues uh, not able to grab half of our model or half of our vertices would be on the other side. So it would have been problematic. So go ahead and start uh, shaping it. Um, let's go ahead and go to side view, make sure we don't have this thing uh, too thick. All right, so we'll start baby steps of just the shape. Um, I need to move that forward. Move this back. All right, so just baby steps, kind of uh, grow this out uh, slowly. All right, so what I'm going to do is go ahead to my front view and kind of extrude it. We're going to keep it very, very simple. Uh, geometry first, and then we'll start uh, cutting it up. So I'm just going to go ahead and pull this up a little bit, start finding the contours of my form here. All right, so I got a face, extrude face, W, pull that out. Again, I'm just going to slowly start modeling this out to that point to here and we can zoom in so I can see what I'm doing here. Okay, let's zoom out, make sure you're doing everything all right. Control should be facing forward a little bit. Yeah, we can always go into side view and start doctoring this up, but first we want just an overall uh, form face. Again, we're only doing one half. We're going to do a duplicate special when we get this form uh, finished. Let's extrude face. Hit W. And we'll hit G. I'm going to do it several times. G, W. G, W. I think we want to keep it simple. Right, that's pretty good. Let's go back to vertex. It looks like there's a flange up here. I think I'm going to treat that differently. So go to the end side here. Okay, we're going to later uh, work on beveled edges and stuff like that, softened edge and stuff like that. We'll work on just a second. First, we're just kind of getting a rough form. Uh, yeah, I'm not 100% how this handle works, so we're going to look at the side view. Yeah, it looks like it kind of goes in separate piece. Okay, so I'll go ahead, right click face, grab the list, let's just make sure that looks alright. So I've grabbed one, two, three, I think. Let's double check that. Looks like it's sitting weird. Make sure you didn't grab anything in the back. All right, so we're going to hit, go ahead and hit extrude edge. Right click, extrude edge. And what do I do? I don't know why my little guy isn't showing up. Usually you have something pop up there. So I'm just going to squeeze this in. Go ahead and pull this out just a bit. I'm going to hit G one more time. I may have to reset my settings. I'm not sure why. Uh, usually you have these anchor points or, or your move tool show up after you do extrusion. Extrusion. All right, so we're just going to go ahead, pull this down. I hit four so I can see through it. Pull this out. Hit five. Good. 
So we're going to extrude this out a couple more times. All right, so we're going to extrude. Extrude face. Do two more of these. Vertex. All right, it's looking pretty good. So we're going to do some extrusions up here. Let's do that real quick. And it will stop, and then we'll have to start shaping this out and then start working on our beveling. All right, so I'm going to go ahead. I think it's these top ones right here. One, two, three. Let's make sure that's okay. Let's go ahead and grab this because I know it's going to kind of go down. So I'm going to shift, extrude, uh, face, W. Put on that, R. Pull this guy down. This is way up high because we can see this starts way down. So I'll pull that forth. Okay, then we're gonna go side view here. It looks pretty good. Let's clean it up. Pull these things out a little bit. Good. Go back to here. All right, looking good. Okay, so that looks good. We'll probably double it. We'll play around. Uh, I think I'm gonna stop for now. Just go ahead and make sure you, you save. So this is a good uh, base. We definitely gotta do a lot of shaping on the side. Uh, profile, but basically that's your basic shape. Keep it simple. Try to keep it uh, without having to do separate objects and models, but uh, I'm going to stop there. It looks good.